What is up everyone and welcome back to a live feed. Um, this is going to be a review on the Dad's Old Fashioned Root Beer. Um, this is a, a product I've been able to get over at the store. Um, just like the description says. So, um, Yeah, so we're going to be uh, doing a review on that, or I'm going to be doing one. Um, she is actually doing a channel of her own now. Um, me and her are still friends with each other, but that's pretty much it. That's all it's going to be, uh, just friends with each other. So that's why you're not seeing any videos from her on this channel. Um, so that just, because I know a lot of people have been wondering that as well, so. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to try this out for you guys. Um, it's caffeine free. And it's supposed to be America's Premium Root Beer. Is what it says there. So I'm going to open it up and try it out for you. And I'm hoping this is a twist top because it would be a lot easier if it is. So I'm going to set my camera over so I can actually open it. I might be moving around on you guys a little bit, so sorry about that. Okay, let's put this here. Yeah, let's put this here. There we go. Well, that's a lot easier. Okay. Let's see if this is... No, this is... No, it's actually not. Um, it's a root beer. It's, um, anybody can drink these ones. Is a twist top, sweet. No, it's just regular root beer, is all it is. It's, there's no alcohol in it or anything like that. So, okay, so let's give this a shot. And it's from that's produced uh, under the authority of Dad's Root Beer Company in Jasper, Indiana. So, here we go. That's actually different from the other one that I've had. Um, I usually drink the Barg's root beer. Um, they also have a whole bunch of other ones as well with that one. Um, this one tastes a little different than that one does. Uh, than the other brands I've had. It almost has like a slight taste of vanilla mixed in, but I don't know if it's because of the, um, what they put in it or not, but, oh, that's what it is, it's the caramel color and the pure cane sugar, that's what gives it that interesting flavor, that, um, a little bit, gives it a little bit different flavor than the other root beers that I've had. Um, so yeah, this is, I like this one actually too. That sounds good. I like root beer. Well, you'll definitely like this one because this one, like I said, is different from the other root beers. So you might want to uh, give this one a try. Um, you can also let me know, um, what your thought is on it after you try it out. I think you'd like it. I've liked all the root beers that I've had, uh, that I've, um, that I get at the store, and I definitely, um, if they didn't have any other types of root beers, this would definitely be one I would end up getting. Um, just because I like to try the different ones out. Uh, my hair was not cooperating today. So... Yeah, I would definitely recommend this one. Um, on a scale from a... A lot of people have been wondering if I'm going to do 1 through 10 still, or if I'm going to do um, A through F. Um, I've had multiple people ask me to change it back to grade schooling. Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to end up doing with the grading. 
um, how I'm going to grade different products, whether it be 1 through 10, 1 through 100, or A through F. Um, I was actually going to leave that up to you guys. Uh, which do you think would be the best for me to do that? Because I always like to get everybody's opinion on um, the way that they think that they that I should do it. I've always done 1 through 10, just because that's an easier way of doing the grading. Um, so definitely throw out suggestions if you guys want to. That, that'd be really cool. Uh, I would give this, if I was doing 1 through 10, I would give this a, a definitely a 10 out of 10 for this. Um, it definitely is really good. It's as good as the other one. 1 through 10, it makes more sense. Yeah, it does, actually. Uh, yeah, 1 through 10, definitely, to me, is also makes more sense as well. So This definitely gets a 10 out of 10 for me. Um, it's There's nothing... Um, I mean, it's pretty much even with all the other root beers that I've had, so this is definitely something I would end up getting again. Um, and I've liked every single one of them so definitely check them out if you've never had it I know a lot of places have it I found this at my Safeway um, that's where I found it anyways so um, I know this is a short live video for you guys but I wanted to at least make sure one was put on for you so um, I appreciate everyone's um, Everybody that has subscribed to the channel, definitely check out all the different live feeds I've done and other videos as well. And if you have any suggestions on other videos, um, thanks for me a review. Just um, make sure to leave them in the comment section below. I'll make sure to get to them. And I'll make sure that I put them on for you, whether it be a live feed or just recording. So... Um, Thank you all for watching. Be sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, everyone, feel the jets so we can keep them flying. Uh, I keep getting that wrong every time. Sorry about that. Uh, feel the jets so we can kick the tires and light the fires because I feel the need for speed. Just like my hair is already, looks like it's been in the wind a little too long, so. Thank you all for watching and stay tuned for more exciting reviews. Take care.